Democratic leaders are scrambling to avoid a government shutdown. Senate Republicans block debate on a bill that would have extended government funding through December. Democrats must now find another way to keep the government operating before a shutdown this Friday. The Department of Homeland Security will publish a proposed rule today that would preserve and fortify the DACA program. The proposal would recreate the programs as it was announced in 2012. The move comes months after a federal judge here in Texas ruled the program unconstitutional and halted its acceptance of applications. Several high-ranking Pentagon officials will appear before the Senate Armed Services Committee today to testify about the withdrawal from Afghanistan. The House Armed Services Committee will hear from Pentagon officials tomorrow. The Obama Presidential Center expected to break ground in Chicago today amid years of pushback. The $500 million center will consist of a museum, forum, public library, plaza, playground, and trails. The ceremony is expected to start around 1 p.m. Growing backlash over a judge's decision to release John Hinckley Jr., the man who attempted to assassinate President Ronald Reagan in 1981. A federal judge ruled that now 66-year-old can be freed from all restrictions next year. Pharmaceutical companies working on a pill that could fight COVID-19 early after diagnosis. Pfizer is one company testing the pill, which they say could prevent symptoms and limit transmission. At least three different pills are in the works. Results could come as soon as late fall or winter. Ford is recalling nearly 18,000 of its Mustang Mach-E vehicles. The company says windshields and a glass sunroof may not have been bonded properly. If you think your car is involved in this recall, you can visit your nearest dealer for a reinstallation free of charge. Another Britney Spears documentary is heading to streaming services. Britney vs. Spears hits Netflix today. It focuses on the two and a half year long investigative process into the conservatorship between the pop star and her father. Krispy Kreme is adding a festive new item to its menu, cinnamon rolls. The donut shop is only selling cinnamon rolls for a limited time and they are only available at participating locations. And that's today's Nine at Nine.